Drone video, St. Patrick's Day at King Pine Resort in New Hampshire. What a gorgeous day. After that big storm, you know, I was so stoked for the four feet of snow in Vermont. I kind of overlooked how nice the weekend weather was going to be. It was cardboard box race weekend. It is springtime after all here at King Pine. And this weekend, it's going to be almost as nice. We're not getting the four feet of snow, but it is snowing. Places like Jay Peak here. Uh, this is video from Tuesday. It was snowing we got close to 10 inches before that Arctic breeze blew in. Uh, that's why I'm hiding in Mum's Cadillac again on Cape Cod. We have a blue sky. No snow on the ground here, but uh, there's snow on the ground just about everywhere else in the east, especially Pennsylvania north. Now, this weekend is a challenging forecast. The air in Maine is coming from the North Pole. The air in New York City is coming from the Gulf of Mexico, and there's a boundary in there that's going to have some precipitation. I think it looks like first part of the weekend, Friday, Friday night, we get a bit of snow, maybe some freezing rain that should dry up for Saturday. The farther you go north, Sugarloaf points north, it's kind of wintry, classic spring type skiing. Farther you go south, uh, is beach still open in North Carolina? It's gonna be in the 70s in North Carolina. And in between there, there's a layer of clouds. So you may end up with some kind of foggy, drizzly type weather in central New York to say the Berkshires of Massachusetts. Uh, this is the grand finale of the Ski the East free ride tour at Jay Peak Resort this weekend. 10 fresh, like we said, and it probably turns dry for Saturday, and then clouds return on Sunday, and it should be classic with temperatures in the 20s at night and 30s, maybe 40s by day, and not too much wind. There is going to be a storm brewing. It's going to come up from the south, probably an inside runner. That means it could be more rain at the shore and snow only at the highest, most northern and westernmost elevations. And that would be Sunday night and Monday, and we're not done with the chill. Now, I know the temperature went to 20 below zero on Mount Washington on our Wednesday night and early Thursday. Uh, that really eases, and next week there's not as cold a batch, but uh, this is the third intrusion of Arctic air, really st saved our ski season here in the east, and next week we're going to be on the boundary with the warm air to the south and cold air to the north, and it is going to rain and snow off and on a lot of next week, so uh, at uh, King Pine, this is final weekend, it's uh, pond skimming, so a lot of the festivities should be a go this weekend, and as we move on into late March and April, the, the party season's going to look good because uh, the snow depth on Mount Mansfield is still close to 100 inches, and a lot of places are going to stay open right through April. We'll see you on the slopes.